Oh, are we? Are we? Are we ready? <coughs> are we ready? Okay, good. Uh, today is uh, today is round two. Uh, another roasting your reload. Yay! I wanna kill myself. Ooh, ooh! I can't believe I that was my grandma. Um, I walk in the living room. All right, we we're gonna take. We're gonna have to take liberties. All right. So, all right. So basically, today we are gonna look. I'm gonna type the word. I type the word nerf reloads in my here, and now we're just gonna look for nerf reloads that I haven't seen before. So, yay! We have oh, we have nerf reloads. Mini easy. Okay. Why is it so shaky? Okay, the recoil animation was really bad. Ooh, nice ADS, nice ADS. Really nice ADS animation. So he's obviously doing the Black Ops one. Uh, there's a lot of unnecessary wobble in your hand. Like you just hold it right there. It's not that hard. Just hold it. Hold it still. It's not that hard, guys. Uh, hold it still, Jesus. Okay. Uh, you know what? To expedite expedite the process, what we're gonna do is I'm gonna put upload date right here, and I'm just gonna see. Look at the. Reload set have been uploaded. So nerf reload by YGG Sean. Huh? Is this is this Raptor Strike broken? Or is this the Alpha Hawk? I forgot. Yeah. Is this Alpha Strike Alpha Hawk broken? It looks like he hesitated there. Okay. Nerf reload one six three by Nerf two. Oh, bad trigger discipline though. But but that's an interesting concept for the reload. Just wish it was executed better. Uh. Less of unnecessary movement. Uh, he's actually got it down, so he must have uh practiced this before doing it. Uh, uh, trigger discipline not there, obviously. Um, and this is a this is a third person view, but it's from the side, so not optimal. Try from try from first person next time. Nerf retaliator speed reload by the goofball gaming. That was, an, that was a awkwardly quick, quick inspect. Okay, uh, this POV angle is uh, not very optimal because you know it's in portrait, so you can't really see that much. The FOV is also zoomed in a lot. So the problem with uh, high FOV is that you no, know, sorry, an FOV that is zoomed in. You know the one that's like zoomed the fuck in. All right, the problem with that is of course you can't see the full thing. So yeah. Inspect is way too fast. Well, inspect it optimal res uh inspect it should be hold it, then you turn. Right? So yeah. See see that was the problem. So immediately turn he takes a quick peek and he just returns back. So that's not very good in the concept of the inspect. I'm guessing what happened there was he flicked the blaster down, uh used the inertia you know, to push the mag up. And then at the same time, you know, he did the retaliate slight trick, so yeah. Okay, how kids reload nerf guns? So already we have a red flag because it's called a gun. How they actually do it versus how everyone describes it. Okay, not as smooth, but... 
you didn't you, you didn't reload it though but you, you didn't you didn't reload it though you, you you're just loading you just load it This video physically hurts me. The fact that it's your closest as well is cursed. Alright. Uh, Nerf AK Reload by Botman666. Oh, he's made his own charging handle. Okay. The angle is very bad though. Okay, so he's got the, the concept pretty decent. Um, But... You know, you know, you don't reload an AK by taking the mag and bumping it on the side. You have to, you either use it as a knife and you hit it against your magazine release, or you take, you have your mag in one hand, one mag, you have the other mag, use the thumb to push it out, and you rock it in, and then you underhand charge. Uh, in concept, this is good, but uh, the angle is also really bad. Assumingly, it's taken from here, and that's why the you can see the stock is so high up. You're gonna want a angle that you can see your hand, the top of your hand. You can see the top of your hand, right? So preferably, it's from either above your eyes. That's so you can you can afford to bring it higher, or to obtain a true hit fire look. Have your your camera here, all right, and then you and then your your blaster here. So this is about halfway. Halfway of your torso, uh, roughly about the end of your rib cage. Nerf double strike reload. Oh, he's got the double hand grip. That's cool. Okay, okay. So his his handgun fundamentals are the greatest. The shit. Uh. Bad trigger discipline, obviously, you know, you know, I have to comment on it, you know, it's, it's, it's kind of my thing, I'm supposed to comment on it, right? Anything that, that is, that, uh, has the, the same form and function as a firearm, you know, I just have to comment on it. Uh, the crib is really weird, the way he grips it is really weird. Optimally, you're gonna have to go for this grip if you want to hold for a sidearm, hold it like this, alright? Unless if you're if you're replicating the style from a, from a different video game and you state it clearly what you're replicating, you shouldn't be holding it any other style than this. Alright, so you can choose to have this hand, this this thumb push for, for the back. I've seen shooters where they have this, have it like this. Yeah. Uh, normally I I hold my 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 side arms like this. So it's a double it's a two handed grip. That's the reason why we chose to adopt it instead of the point and shoot technique that was used in World War Two. This is to help you aim better. Alright, to help you shoot better, alright? Come on. So guys, fix your grip. At least he's in first person though and uh, I believe the camera angle is alright. Cool music. Jesus the music. What is he doing? Okay, what the fuck? Uh, what is this script? What, what are you doing? If you want to spin it, hold on, let me get some, let me show you something. So, let me grab a scissors and I'll show you the right way to spin it. Got this thing. Okay, so, we have a scissors, alright? We have a scissors. Spin it. With your trigger finger, right? Let's say this is a blaster. It's a blaster, right? Hold on, let me show you. Let's say this is a blaster, right? You put your trigger, your trigger finger into your trigger grip, right? Off the trigger as per as per usual. Then you can spin it, and then you return, right? So you spin and you return, all right? I can visualize what he was trying to go for. He was trying to do a spin equip. Then spin, and then do the reload. But the problem here is that he doesn't actually fucking reload at all. What he does is he spins the cylinder, he puts it back in, and then he spins it again. Uh, uh that's not reloading, buddy. Uh, that's shit.
is this a is this a Megatron TV subscriber? Because uh, he it definitely is. It, it, I think this is a Megatron TV subscriber. No, I'm just saying. Of course, you got to do that fake recorder. All right, next video. Nerf fast reload by the relatable lemon and what the fuck? Okay, it looks this looks like you're by the same person, but or actually. What I never understood is why people cut out the, uh, cut out the, the whole first part of the reload, you know, it's supposed to be. That's not even that fast, you know, I'm just, you're just saying, what he really did in the video was just, you could see, I mean, come on, this has to be redone, right? You pull back, then you insert, and it, Jesus, fuck. Guys, show us the full clip, not a cut version of it. Is it that hard to do? Relatable real. I think it's by the same guy. Nerf fast flick re Okay, come on, you oh jeez. Guys, reload with the slide forward. Reload it after you just fired it. Alright, so you just fired it. You don't touch anything. Then you execute the full thing. You know, this is a this is obviously a this functions the same way as a Vitalia, it functions the same way as a Delta Trooper. This is the Echo, is it, is it the name? Is fuck. Echo, yeah, I can't give shit for this one. You didn't show you pulling back the slide, for fuck's sake. Just do the full thing and come out the trigger discipline is so bad. Guys, is it that hard to keep your finger on the trigger? Oh, for the love of Christ. Daily Nerf Reload, Black Ops 2, FN57. FN57. Does does he not? The 57 is a pistol. The the 57 is a pistol. The 57 is a pistol. Yeah, yeah, but I can definitely see the Black Ops 2 uh 57 reload in this. So the 57 reload is what we do uh the it's a mag retention reload. Uh so One hand, you grab your round, uh, you grab your, you grab your spare mag, I mean your your new mag, two fingers, you grab it, come underneath here as you click the magazine release. This hand is gonna grab the old mag out, and you're gonna change. And for Black Ops Two, what it did was, yeah, for Black Ops Two, what it did actually was, uh, so they pushed this up at the same time. Yeah, your fingers unlatch. Right, your fingers. This finger drops the the mag, and then the mag actually pops out. So, yeah, essentially it's that. So it's quite faithfully represented. Just that I, I'm I'm curious as to why he holds it like it's a rifle. You know, you know the spectrum you can actually hold it as a pistol. You know, it's it's alright. I've done that before. I've done that before. You carry it. So this is. Option A choice here is pretty odd, but you know what? Why not? Alright, that's numeric reloads. Now we have Epic Nerf Reload by Caleb Play. And I'm not watching that relatable lemon guy. He seems like he seems like he's just another fuck an, another fucking megaphone TV. I'm just not fucking around with it. Can't see if you maintain trigger discipline. Throughout. I can't tell. You should be maintaining trigger discipline while you're doing the reels, by the way. It appears that that his finger was in fact on the trigger. Alright guys, so once again, to make it easier for you to grip the blaster, finger out the trigger, helps to stabilize it, he actually does, alright? Because when you have your finger on trigger, all right, there's a force inwards, all right. So there's a force inwards. You can't keep it back. You're gonna you're supposed to keep that thing straight, wobbly. Not, you know, you know physics, all right. One force here, one force there, all right. If the two forces are the same, then there won't be a resulting force in this direction or this direction, all right. So you know, basic fucking physics. Otherwise, he roughly knows how to do a basic, a basic rank drop, you know. So you, pull my, 
don't lift it up so high because if you lift it up so high, your hand is going to have to chicken wing it in. So you bring it, you draw, or you bring it to the side a little bit, insert, then you bring your side forward. Alright, this is an easier, it's an easier way to do it. I don't know why he just bought his, bought, twisted his whole fucking wrist just to do one. Alright, just a nerf spin reload by 3, 2, 1, reload. Oh, oh, he's snappy. Oh, shit. Yo. Oh. It actually pretty is this. Nerf stuff channel. I've been seeing these fucking comments everywhere. It's from, it's from, it's just from Russia. I don't think this is his content. I feel like, I feel like some of, some of the content here are not his, but you know what? Let's see. Nerf reload. Very bad trigger discipline. Uh, wow. Uh, see. Um, actually, the the way magazine releases look, you only need to press it once, take out your mag. You can actually retract your your mag. Keeping this on the magazine well, uh, on the magazine release looks really bad, and at the same time. You can accidentally push a uh, hit, hit it, and then you know your mag drops out. So after you hit the magazine release, take the mag out, bring your finger in, and fucking keep your trigger. This Jesus Christ! All the videos that I've had, that I've seen so far, practically none of them have had any form of trigger discipline, except for the one with the uh the uh the FN five seven reload. I think so. Yeah. Stop. Trigger discipline. Alright, this one doesn't count because he's spinning the blaster, right? Nerf Echo 2.0 Reload. So he's got the, the idea of the inspect quite well. Um brings it out. Close it. Turns it. He's going for a second inspect again. I, I'm 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 quite I'm quite confused as to why. He hasn't maintained trigger discipline. He's not maintaining trigger discipline right there as you can see. Uh, once again, guys, he's got like the. He's got that. He's got the shape pretty, pretty, pretty nailed down. It's quite good. Fucking trigger discipline. Why doesn't anyone on fucking, on fucking YouTube you has trigger discipline, man? Jesus. Nerf reload. Flight. Hashtag nerf. Hashtag reload. Hashtag shorts. Now I don't operate the flight, but but I believe the magazine release is inside a trigger. But at the same time, you press the magazine release once, then your mag comes out. You could just bring the figure out of the trigger. And, come on, guys, it's not that hard. It's just keeping your finger out of the fucking trigger. It's not that hard. It's not. It's not like algebra or some shit. All right. God, don't call it a nerf gun. Don't call it a fucking gun. It's the most. That's the most. I I don't like saying the word cringe, but that's the most cringe shit I've ever seen. If you're gonna call a nerf blaster a gun, it's not a gun. It's a foam dot blaster. All right, foam dot foam dot blaster. Jesus Christ. Christ. I I know because of the algorithm, you have to call it a nerf gun. But come on, it's not a fuck. Just, Call it a blast, please. Otherwise, this a uh, finger inside trigger, but that's, but that's his idle animation, so I can't do much. Most idle animations have their finger inside trigger. But yeah. my, I can't tell from from the from the camera, but when he puts his his hand back on the blaster, does he maintain trigger discipline? I don't think he does, and uh, yeah, uh, trigger discipline, guys, come on. Once again, it's not that fucking hard. <sighs> trigger! <laughs> oh my god, Curtis Magnet Revolver Reload. Trigger finger! Use Curtis, the angle is really bad as well. Fuck.
and don't call it a god. Jesus. What is it with... I, I can bet that this guy is fucking under the Discord TOS. This guy is not allowed to enter Discord. You know why? Because he's probably fucking 12. And why is it a fucking 12 year old? Why is probably a Nerf gun? A gun. It's a blaster. You know what? Never mind. Nerf reload. Secret. Battlefield reload. Oh, this by the same guy. Sorry. What in the f- Oh, oh, it's a child. It's actually that will explain the whatever the fuck that was. When he took out the mag, he used the same mag, and then fuck, his finger is fucking glued to the trigger. You know what that looks like? I have a, I have a problem. Fucking glued all the way over here. Right? It's been stuck to super glue. It's actually super good. Actually, it's actually good. Uh, you know why? Uh, I reference this because his finger is fucking gorilla glue to the fucking trigger. You know, you know, you know, like like the trigger is the gorilla hair, gorilla glue hair. Girl. This guy, his finger is the hair, and he missed the mag insertion. Jesus Christ! Could you have missed something that? Yeah, and and there we go. That's a squeaker. All right, so a squeaker is basically like remember the, the Xbox three sixty days. Yeah, that's a squeaker. <laughs> Corby, Nerf reload. All right, this 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 makes more sense. Oh, is he the left handed guy? Trigger discipline. I think it's there. His his hand is pushed. His finger is really pushed out at an awkward angle, which is once again it's not very aesthetic looking. All right. Uh, inspect is really fast. It's unnecessarily fast. You're right. For an inspect, you don't want to have too much shake into it. So you hold it. You hold it there. Um, what I like to do is actually, as you can see, my arm right now. I've locked my arm with my with my shoulder right here, so it's locked. It cannot move that much, right? So the only thing that has a chance to move is my wrist. But I keep my wrist stationary. You know why? Because an inspect is not supposed to be you flopping the blaster around like it's a used condom. Now, I say that many times before, but it's true. I've seen many people who botch up inspects by just flopping it around like a used condom, right? Alright, next one. Uh, by Sheik Ali. Actually, no, let's, let's do this one. Yeah, Nerf Reload Part 1. Why do you call it Part 1? It's not 2000. Okay, we got you ready. I'll start it off with the fake. And it's not a reload. You didn't reload. You didn't reload. You primed the blaster. What the fuck has been taught to you? What the fuck is Megatron TV teaching you guys? Priming the blaster is not a reload, it's a rechamber. I'm having fucking pain. I want to do that. Commit that. I want to shoot my cock off after watching shit. Nerf reload. Hashtag nerf. Hashtag shorts. Hashtag reload. Bad trigger discipline once again. Jesus Christ. Alright, so if the fuck. I accidentally click. You wouldn't leave yourself. I accidentally click, click on the cooking meat. If you're gonna wanna do this. You wouldn't need to keep your finger on your magazine release. You can keep the finger on the trigger well. Is he in there? Oh, people are already here before me. <laughs> Work on trigger discipline and mag insertion. Oh, thank you, GD Breeze. G G G yeah. GD Breeze. Why do you post so many of your own videos? What the fuck? Nerf flip reload to oh. Wait, no, I don't wanna watch this again. I wanna I wanna kill myself when I watch that guy's reload. Nerf reload, but actually no. Uh okay. Nerf M1 Garand pistol reload. Domino funny video. Two emojis. Nerf collection. Biz guns. Nerf war. Hashtag shorts. You know how you you know how, how fucking retarded this sound? Sound like one of those moms on Facebook that that reuses hashtags to sound funny. 
back is alright. So he's simulating an M block crit right here. I just, oh my god, the way he fucking squeezes. Squeezes a dodge, it just hurts him on a straight or whatever. Oh my god, if you want to fake an M on Garang, you can do, do it from this side, alright? You load it in, and then you M the once you load your M block clip in, charging hand, the bolt actually goes forward, alright? So once you load it in, it disengages the lock, which push which allows the bolt to ride forward. So either either you have one of those fancy garen that you uh that has that bolt hold open feature thing, but like I like I don't study the garen that much, right? So just push it in, alright, for that one. Push it in, then you can just release charging hand and go forward. But this is not that one. Uh, the only thing about this that is related to the Garand is, of course, you know, the M block clip portion. But that's not even an M block clip. An M block clip is actually more like a double stack magazine rather than a single stack where bullets are directly on the rounds are directly on top of each other. A double stack one is when the rounds are lined up like this, but not directly on top of each other, right? They're actually side, kind of like side by side, diagonally stacked. This allows for more rounds within that same volume of space. That's what an M block clip. So you got an M block clip, and then you got the rounds that stack on top of each other, like a double stack mag, not like a single stack mag, as in a strip clip from like a Car ninety eight or any bolt action rifle that you've seen, right? And there's no trigger discipline. What do I expect? He's everywhere. Can I skip this? Nerf reload, but there's no need to take out Mac. Peace out. Trigger! What the fuck did he just do? Imagine, imagine being that much of a desperate shooter, you gotta have, you gotta put, please stop right there. Why, why, why did you feel the? Oh, okay. I, I'm guessing that's how that's how the finisher works. But I don't use the finisher, so yeah. Nerf, Chris, Vector, Reload. You gotta put the Vector in capital letters, man, because nobody will know that it's actually a Vector. Where's the Vector in this? Where's the Chris Vector in this? You guys want to know what that Chris Vector looks like? I'm sorry that I'm sorry that Phantom Forces on Roblox doesn't teach this to you, but uh, this is oh okay, it's on Phantom Forces, of course. This is a Chris Vector, all right. It's a Chris Vector. This is a stealth machine gun, obviously by Chris USA, and I never forgive you for not making the fucking Chris card, all right. How is this like a Chris Vector? You, you know there's a Chris Vector strife kit. You don't need to use the Apollo to do his Chris fuck. He's got 14k views and he has he has 1.6k subs. Oh, what Megaton TV thinks about how loops reload. Okay, interesting. Oh, fuck. When the Oh, when the fucking magazine hit the wall, it actually hurt me on a spiritual level. Jesus Christ. Stop. Oh, fuck my ear. Good lord. You know, the ironic thing is that many people that actually watch uh, Megaton TV are really just prepubescent children. What else can I say? And it's few. It is reborn guys' videos. He has more views than me. What the fuck? I'm just not gonna watch this. I've seen this guy already. Nerf reload by must be tough. When will you see my reloads here? Actually, I haven't seen my yet. But okay. Mine on action. Oh, so it's a break action. What are the? What is the point of? Can't even see the. You can't even see the. Oh my! It's fucking why. Alright. Dolls, Imperial, Blast of Reload, Nerf Guns, Hashtag Donkey, Hashtag Subscribe.
All right, after we read this one, I'll show you what an actual good video looks like. All right, guys. I don't, I don't do a Star Wars, but so I don't know how the thing is supposed to work. All right, so. The wind is blowing really hot, really uh, a lot, so I hope that the audio doesn't pick up on it too much. Let me show you what a good fucking reload looks like. Alright, so recently I released my Daily Reloads Remastered series, uh, which is which is me redoing my old reloads, alright? So let me show you what an, one of my oldest reloads looks like, alright? So my oldest reload. I recommend you just look through Daily Reloads because that was really what kick-started the channel right here and I'm thankful that that we had daily reloads but what I'm not thankful for is how shit I am for in these early videos alright we have daily reload hashtag one uh, because this mo this was my numbering system alright uh, so for the start already the problem what for what I did here was that I was bracing the stop against this arm and it was and I was relying on this arm just hang by itself and stabilize. What I was supposed to do was to actually bring my arm in and brace it against my shoulder so that it's stable. So in this, in this, it gives that very low quality look when it's branched out to the side a bit too much. So when I twisted my, my wrist a bit too much for this, so that was a problem. Um, let's look at just an AK reload, daily reload, hashtag number four. God, I can't, I can't say hashtag on the road. So this was fuck. This was way back when uh when I was figuring out how to do the AK reload. Um because I was I was watching YouTube tutorials and to hit the magazine with this and time time when I hit the mag out using the the new one like a like a knife, it's it's just really fucking hard and I didn't want to do that. So I did this, which was eventually gonna devolve into that. So I need I was learning and then this is just really fucking bad. Look, the reload is out of frame as well. Look at look at the camera ratio. Jesus fuck. And of course, and of course, look at the angle, man. Oh, it's horrible. Good lord. Good lord. Did your mom hold the camera for you? <laughs> that's one of my oldest insults. Alright, uh... That's from when I first started, alright? So let's look at something uh, later on in my time. Uh, let's look at Fortnite scholarships, alright? This is, this is today, one, this is today, my actually, my most popular video. Because it got, look, look, look at the views. <laughs> it's 131k views. Uh, unfortunately for me, good first person reloads like this aren't mainstream. They don't get a lot of views. They get the shit ones get views, but uh, of course, God forbid, the actually good ones don't get anything. So, uh, for context, uh, this video was actually uploaded at my friend's house. So I went there after school, and I and I was like, "Hey, can you lend me a blaster? Do you have a blaster?" And actually, actually, no. The conversation went more of like I went there to visit him, and said hi, you know, stick around, chill, and then. He told me there was blasters lying around his house, and I was like, "Oh shit! You mind if I borrow one?" And he brought out the Fortnite scar, and I—that was my first experience with it. This was, I believe, this was one of my first year experiences. So I tried, really, just tried replicating that model. You could already see that my my star had uh reflared out. So yeah, we're gonna stop here for today. Uh, do the usual YouTube things, you know, leave a like, comment, subscribe, share. So I'll see you guys next time. Good.